Over half of adults have some form of gum disease. And uh, some of the symptoms of gum disease is bleeding when you brush or when you floss, some malodor. However, actually, a lot of gum disease has no pain at all. I always tell people there's two ways to lose your teeth. You can lose them through getting decay and the teeth just basically rotting in your mouth. But you can also not have any decay in your mouth at all and have gum disease where your teeth will actually slowly over years, sometimes it can take decades, but you will slowly lose bone and, and gum and the proverbial long in the tooth. And what happens is you'll lose your teeth just by them being loose. First thing we do when patients come in, we, we always make sure we check their gums. And if we see that they do have gum disease, the first line of treatment is some kind of cleaning. Typically we do something like a deep cleaning, which is a scaling and a root planing procedure. And we do get people numb for that so that they'll be comfortable. And then we, we assess after that procedure to see how they've healed. And from there is when we decide if they need to either be referred to a specialist for more extensive gum therapy, or if they can be on a routine cleaning here at our office. And sometimes, you know, the, the normal is every six months you should come in and have your teeth cleaned. That's for a normal, healthy individual. But some people who have had a history of gum disease, they might need to come in more often, every three to four months. Again, we, we want to show you how to take care of your gums and we will do that. We will also get you on a regular routine appointment to be able to come in, whether it's every three to four months or every six months. And so by coming in and seeing a hygienist to have your teeth cleaned professionally, we can go in and get to all the areas that you just habitually always miss. Again, we'll tell you where you're missing so that you'll be informed and know how to do better. And we've seen some great progress with our patients.